What up, y'all? It's your guy Dawson from D&D TV. Thank you for rating, commenting, and subscribing. Everybody who's donated, those of you all who will, also go over to my other YouTube channel, Dawson Speaks TV. Make sure you subscribe over there and uh, click that notification bell so you get notifications when I drop a new video. Now, let's get into this topic. All right, y'all. Thanks for clicking on the video. I hope you all are doing well. Now, as I approach this topic with respect, I need you all to please, please, please be respectful in my comment section. Thanks. Now, the last story I did came out of Houston, Texas, and this story is coming out of Dallas, Texas. So it seems we're still stuck in Texas. Now, when I first heard this story, I was upset and I thought to myself, there's no way that stuff like this is taking place after church, especially on Resurrection Sunday. Surely this has to be false. That's what I thought. And then some individuals who were close to this particular situation told me, no, Dawson, it's all true. Denzel LeVar Branch, 31 years old, was a faithful member at New Generations Kojic Church in Dallas, Texas. Denzel loved his family, friends, and the congregants that he was able to fellowship with on a weekly basis. So much so that at one point in his existence, Denzel was the youth pastor at New Generations Kojic Church. Denzel had a heart for the young people and it showed, not only in the way that he inspired the youth at the church, but also in the way that he was raising his own children. Now, Denzel did marry a woman who he thought was the love of his life. However, that marriage ended last year in 2023. Still, in spite of a failed marriage and day-to-day -day trials that most of us go through in life, Denzel was determined to continue to move forward and lead a better life. However, this past weekend, Easter Sunday 2024, things took a turn for the worse. After church service, Denzel got into an argument with the piano player, Joshua Bell Andrews, who is the adopted son of Christopher Andrews, who is the older brother of Superintendent Eric Andrews, who is the pastor of New Generations Kojic Church in Dallas, Texas. Now, Christopher Andrews did make his transition, and I want to send my condolences out to Superintendent Eric Andrews, the church, and to his family. Now, according to the arrest affidavit, the piano player, Joshua Xavier Bell Andrews, told police that he had been involved in an intimate relationship since May of 2023 with Denzel's ex-wife, who divorced Denzel around November 2023. But everybody who knows this situation, Mr. Piano Man, they know that you were messing with his wife while they were still together. Now, that argument after church escalated, and it led to Denzel Branch allegedly hitting Joshua, and Joshua Bell pulled out a weapon and ran after Denzel Branch and unalived him down the road from the church in front of bystanders. Now, many witnesses say they heard several shots, and that Joshua Xavier Bell Andrews had completely lost it. All right, y'all, let's go in. First of all, I want to send my condolences out to the family, friends, and associates of Denzel Branch. I know that you all loved him and you miss him terribly, and I have and will continue to pray for his children. Now, I want to say this, and you all know I'm going to say whatever I want to say on the YouTube show Denise and I created and cultivated. If you don't like it, you know what to do. I want to say this to some, not all, some church people who play games. What do you mean play games, Dawson? I mean you're playing games when you're in the church and you're sitting up there up under the word of God. You're a pastor, a deacon, a piano player, a usher, prophet, prophetess. And a lot of you all, not everybody, but some of you all, you'll cheat on your husband, on your wife. Go after someone else's husband or wife and then you come to church and you act like everything is okay. How can you sit under the word of God and play those games. And then you all wonder, why don't people want to come to church? Oh, they just don't want nothing to do with the Lord. No, they don't want anything to do with you because there's no difference between you and the people in the world. Oh, Dawson, I just don't like y'all vloggers. Y'all just don't want people to come to church. Well, if they're carrying on like this at church, you shouldn't be there either. Think of the people who were outside after that church service, it, who witnessed this, people who lived in the neighborhood. A lot of them took to social media. Don't take my word for it. Look this stuff up on social media and see what everybody is saying. I didn't make this up. And I know there are people on social media who say, well, Denzel started. He threw the first hit and all this stuff. And that may be true. 
But then in that case, you fight back. But to do what you did, Joshua, Andrews, chase him down and just unload like that? No, dog, you, you're, not going, you, you're not getting away from that. You're not getting away from that, Joshua, Xavier, Bell, Andrews. And I know because I get your letters. And people going to say, well, Dawson, don't be like that. The church is a hospital. Well, look here, Miss Hospital. You ain't, you ain't going to never get healed? You ain't going to never have strength, never have power? Y'all used to sing the song, there's power, power, wonder working power in the precious blood of the Lamb. You ain't going to never experience that at no point in your existence? Let me calm down. Because to me, that's just an excuse. He knows he shouldn't have been after that man's wife. And she knows that she shouldn't have been cheating on her husband. You're not innocent in this. Now, let me say this. There are some people online who are saying that the church people are telling other people to be quiet about the situation and not to post things on social media. And even there were some people talking that uh, Joshua Bell is uh, not putting Joshua Bell Andrews because he was going by Joshua Andrews because he was supposed to get in the footsteps of his uncle and his father by being, you know, a leader in the church. But now that he is arrested for this and it's all over the media, he's going by Joshua Bell now. A lot of people are having a problem with that. But I'm going to call you what, I, what you were saying before. Joshua Xavier Bell Andrews. I don't care how they try to clean it up on social media. You can't clean it up. No matter what they do, Joshua is always going to be linked to that church and to this situation. It's tragic. Now, the church... New Generations Kojic Church in Dallas, Texas, they did, you know, release a statement online. You all can read it. I don't feel like reading it, all right? Because I think what you all should have been doing, the leaders in that church, is talking to your piano player and telling him that it was wrong for him to be involved with a married woman or talking to her about the situation as well. You all, this situation is just completely sad, but I'm going to leave you all with this. If you're in a church or any other institution where a person has had inappropriate interactions with your spouse or made advances towards your spouse, or maybe someone tried to be inappropriate with one of your little ones, or maybe you had bad business dealings with someone at the church, and every time you see them, you feel some type of way. I mean, let's be honest. You feel some type of way and you can't shake it. Do yourself a favor. Do yourself a favor. Find another church. Go somewhere where you have peace of mind. Sometimes you just got to start again. Start over. New people, new atmosphere, and a new perspective. And that's okay. It's okay, y'all. Really, it is. Again, I send my condolences out to the family, friends, and associates of Denzel LaVar Branch. You all get down in the comments section. Let me know what you think about this topic. Please be respectful in the comments. Please be respectful in the comments. Thumbs up the video. Share the video with family and friends. Those who support this channel and say, my brother Dawson, you bless me. I want to support your channel. I want to bless you back. You all know what to do. Thank you for the love. Thank you for the su support. I love you all. Until next time, take care of yourself. Take care of yourself. Please take care of yourself and each other. Peace.